One hour, NASA will crash a spacecraft into an asteroid, all in the name of protecting planet Earth. It's scheduled to take place at 614 our time. The spacecraft has been flying to its target since launching last year. This could be exciting. Jason Miles live with more on the mission. Jason, it all sounds very science fiction like. That's right, Lynn, or maybe like a movie. Remember those uh, asteroid related movies back in the 90s? This mission is called DART, and its primary reason for coming into existence is to let NASA and others learn more about possibly better protecting us here on Earth in the future. Part of the plot in a popular 1990s movie is reality in 2022. We've never done this before. A NASA spacecraft set to intentionally strike an asteroid 6.7 million miles from Earth while traveling 14,000 miles per hour. Uh, at 7.14 Eastern, um, the DART spacecraft is going to impact an asteroid and try to change its orbit. NASA chief scientist Kate Calvin spoke with me today about the DART, or Double Asteroid Redirection Test. And which launched last November atop a SpaceX rocket. The asteroid we're hitting is a small asteroid that orbits a slightly larger asteroid. Basically like a bug hitting an SUV, but enough nudge to slightly alter the smaller asteroid's orbit the way scientists hope we could do to any potentially hazardous Earth-bound objects in the future. And DART is part of that effort. It's a test of a technology. And part of NASA's larger planetary defense strategy on which CBS space analyst Bill Harwood has reported extensively. They want to prove that you have the ability to deflect an asteroid if they ever spot one heading toward Earth on a collision course. I'm told the odds of an asteroid hitting the Earth with devastating impact are remote, but the consequences are extreme and worth trying to prevent. And there's actually a secondary space uh, vehicle up there watching this happen. That will provide a great video, we hope and uh, certainly data that NASA and others can use to make sure this mission went off the way they wanted to and then learn all they need to about it uh, and how to relate that to future episodes. Uh, again, you mentioned 614 our time. I'll have another update from here coming up then. Reporting live from JSC, Jason Miles, KHOU 11 News. Well, that is so fascinating. A test run, what did he call it? A bug hitting an SUV? I mean, <laughs> wow. Something like that, despite <laughs> the size of it all. Thank you, Jason.